coach, we've got the approach down. We've got it nailed. We're doing it perfect. But yet I go to the bowling center, and sometimes, you know, and I think I'm really throwing it good, but I miss the head pin right. Or I even miss the head pin left uh, on my first ball, my strike ball. I, it seems like I'm, boy, I'm off today. Let's talk about that subject. Well, I tell you what, now the fun begins because now you've developed your physical game. Now it's finding out how to get the ball to the pocket and to strike. And so your job when you come in every evening is to get your original starting position. And a lot of times it's going to be with your left foot around the big center dot, maybe a little left of it, a little right of it. For me, a lot of times it's a little right of it, so I can play around the second arrow in that track area when I come into bowling league play. So you know what happens according to the weather uh, and how much bowling's been on the lane. Some days when you come in, the lanes are a little drier. You don't see it with your eyes, but you should see it with your ball. Your ball seems, boy, my ball's really curving more today. Or let's go in when it got cold out. The lanes have a little cold uh, moisture in them and they put oil on top and the heat and the oil really is slick and your ball's just sailing right down the lane. It's like playing on the icy streets or dry pavement. That's your decision. So you can move a little left or you can move a little right. You move to the right when they're oily. You move to the left when they're dry. So come into the bowling center, find your normal position, throw some warm-up shots, and then say, hmm, they're a little dry tonight. I'm going to move to the left. When your ball goes left, you move left. How many boards left? Four. Okay, move four. My ball missed right. How many boards? Three boards. Move three boards right. So learn to find your strike position first. Then we can worry about making the spares, which we're going to talk about next.